I am ashamed and disappointed that this was the party I spoke for over the years. Ken Okolubo speaks. Welcome to the news and thank you for tuning in to listen. Please subscribe to our channel. Okolubo raised concerns about the lack of intervention by the PDP in the River State political turmoil. He expressed his belief that the party he once spoke for had failed to address the crisis effectively. Notably, he mentioned his active opposition to the government of the President Buhari during his time with the PDP. He suggested that the lack of unity within the party might have contributed to the absence of intervention in the River State situation. Okolubu cited the departure of commissioners in River State as a clear indication of the internal divisions. Questioning how those commissioners could work with the governor, they had left in favor of another. Ken Okolubo, a former People Democratic Party spokesperson and Delta State Commissioner, recently spoke with Arise TV and expressed this deep disappointment and shame about the party's handling of the River State crisis. Having been a fervent supporter of the PDP for many years, Okolubo expressed his disappointment with the organization. He said, I do not understand PDP at all in this whole thing. I was the PDP's former spokesperson, and I am ashamed and disappointed that this was the party I spoke for over the years. When the people could not even bear the Buhari government, that is when I stood against it. It is hard to believe that this was the same party I attended. I was incredibly passionate about it. I concur with your assessment that if the PDP had been in order, the president might not have stepped in. Instead of debating this agreement, consider sending commissioners to be heard. How can commissioners who departedly voluntarily collaborate with a man who has already who has already left due to another man? My dear, even a lot of people are not be only really disappointed, a lot of people are highly disappointed in PDP with the fact that they left this crisis for a very long time. Now whatever is going on in What's it called? Whatever is going on in PDP now with Mickey, whatever is going on with them, you keep asking yourself, how? How did it get to this point? A um, few days ago, a um, few days ago, um, how do I put it now? They came out saying PDP was, um, uh, somebody came out yesterday, yeah, I think yesterday, saying PDP was going to, they are going to treat, they are going to they were, you know, they are going through some things down now that they're going to come outside and speak on the issue that they will still deal with me, Kay, and all of, I'm like, where is this person coming from? If they want to deal with me, Kay, since they will not even come outside to come and say it. The thing is, I want to believe that it is because people in PDP, they, I think they have their hands. If you like it and get skeleton, we get flesh for inside your cupboard. Because tell me why somebody would be this, you know, doing anti-party activities, doing everything he's doing that is against everything the party stands for. And you cannot come outside and say, it's okay. You cannot come outside and call this person to order. It doesn't make sense to me. It doesn't make absolute. And you're coming out to say, no, that's no worry. That you people are doing, you are doing, uh, what's the call? You brought somebody and the person is saying it's not only we kill that did anti-party. You want to find out the people that is doing anti-party too. That after finding them out, you will now come outside and deal with it. I, I finished reading that particular essay. I was like, Shay, is this person a child new? This person is calling us a child. Hmm. Mr. Kolobo, I can feel your pain concerning the inattitude action of PDP. The NWC, the National Working Committee, chairman this position to the whole crisis in River State deserve condemnation. He has become a boy to Mike. Allowing Mike to be part of Tenable's government shows his weakness. I therefore call for his resignation before he kills PDP. My own is that if Mike wants to, had it been PDP stand on their feet and do what they are supposed to do, it is very simple. If Mike wants to join APC, very simple. You go and join the PC. They would have. He would. He would. They would not fling and come out for a very long time. Made juicy ta. But the fact that he's not, they're not throwing him, throwing him outside. It is like they're peddling soft with him. The whole thing is becoming too, too, too annoying. I tell you. Candidly, PDP as a party did not do well 
on this issue. It is very disappointing. You get, they don't do well at all. If PDP as a party did well, eh, or they are doing well, you see this issue between Fubar and Wiki, it wouldn't be like this now. All they need to do is to call, uh, what's the call, Wiki to order, and, you know, viola, the issue is solved. Leave PDP. He is sleeping. After Jonathan, after Jonathan, they sleep till the eyes, the soul of PDP, the APC, and the fellowship, they see, Maybe after 2032, the PDP will go wake up, enter APC, and APC flesh will enter PDP, then a new party go show first. These guys in both PDP and APC will contest on the platform, just like, just like a Pabio, who once called the PDP the greatest party in Africa. In Africa, is singing a new song of APC, the largest party in the whole world. This is your country, and they said they are serving you. Well, maybe you have a point, just maybe. I have not heard of your name before when it comes to politics. You don't need to hear of his name, Sha. He's not coming out to do anything rather than PDP no do well. You don't, do you need to know do you need to do you need to know him before he comes out to give his own two cents concerning the issue between PDP and and you know APC? No. The non reasonable members of PDP should be grateful to President Tunibu for his intervention. What are you saying? Which intervention? Ha, no bah. I concur with you, sir. PDP existing by name, not physical activities. PDP had failed in rivers, disappeared in river state, and left Governor Fubara alone to PDA PC Wiki and bat to free to fish free on river state. This papa deceived Peking PDP all practicing criminals, boy self. Sincerely, this thing with this person right, this PDA PC, you know it should not be their plan. Eh? Maybe he didn't get what he expected from the party. Like what? He's not saying they should give him anything. He's like, you know, PDP has deteriorated to a point where he's not asking questions. You're more. He cannot even recognize the party that he once used to spoke for again. The PDP death is imminent to their shame. If they cannot rise to education after Wiki has it, then it shows that all Wiki boasts are true, that it was one man riot squad holding PDP. And it is very sad. I've said it before, the things, all the things we make the come outside the booth for that time. You understand? If they don't have members of the party that can actually come out and do things for PDP, that means a problem day. That means a big problem. Why would PDP allow itself to be controlled by one person? Why? Hmm. Okay, if they cannot rise to the occasion after we key as it, then it shows that all we can boast are true, that he was one Mon Riot's squad holding PDP. I think Ababaka and Co. should be ashamed of themselves. The few decent people that are left in PDP should join P2B in the Labour Party because I don't see PDP getting on their feet again. Oh. Alright, so on this note, we have come to the end of the news. So thank you for tuning in to listen. Until I come, you'll be next time. Enjoy the rest of your day.